this. I would like to tell you about camp. It was a wonderful childhood experience that keeps coming back to me. Papa paid for the whole thing every summer. All 125 campers on Lake Michigan. Your father was a generous man. Whenever feasible, one should always try to eat the root. Mason, please. Oh. Papa was a prodigy in the field of meat, but his real genius was for human nature. He could look at a man and see his weakness. Your father's dead. The boy's illusions are no basis for a man's life, Mason. Mark was the only family you have left. Good. Garbage. Shall we talk about what happened to poor Margaret? We can get to that later. Well, we can get to it now. Family affairs are best left to the family, Dr. Lecter. You interfered. I provided counsel. You subverted me. When you were subverting the underprivileged children at your summer camp, what did you learn? A keen student of the Bible that I am. I learned about suffering. Mine, mind you, but the general conceit. never say to a certainty, it is one of those things that is hid, as the Bible says. Papa taught me how to hide all sorts of things. This is his knife. I carry it around with me to remind me of him. Whose fat are you planning to measure today, Mason? Mine. No fat on you. Take more than a flesh wound to make you squeal. What game of chicken are you and the sperm donor playing, Dr. Victor? Don't get me wrong. I play chicken with Margot all the time. I'm good at chicken, Dr. Leiter. I never blink. <laughs> Just send me the bill. I'm so sorry.